A small group of demonstrators gathered outside federal court in downtown Ottawa early Wednesday morning. Sierra Club Canada sponsored the protest and is one of the organizations challenging the government's approval of Bay du Nord. It's an oil exploration development off the coast of Newfoundland by a Norwegian-owned company called Equinor. Connor Curtis of Sierra says Canada is simply not equipped to handle a potential oil spill a project like this could produce. Canada uh, as a country is just not prepared to deal with a major oil spill. Uh, they never have been in terms of the previous oil spills that have happened off of Newfoundland and Labrador. Uh, and if there were to be a major oil spill, the technology that would be needed to deal with that, with that spill could take anywhere from 18 to 36 days just to get on site, let alone actually capping that. George Ginnish is the chief of the Natawanag Mi'kmaq Nation. He is also the co-chair chief of Mi'kmaq Well Tiplukan Incorporated, or MTI, which represents nine Mi'kmaq communities in New Brunswick. Ginnish says they are concerned about what a potential oil spill could do to salmon stocks. The downstream impacts can can be huge. I mean, we look at, you know... A, I guess the horror stories like the uh, you know the Gulf of Mexico, the you know the oil blowout there, things like that. They really it, it concerns us. Especially. He says MTI is also frustrated that once again First Nations were not properly consulted. And we've had we've had this happen too many times in the past, where government you know will come to us at late in the game without adequate resources for full consultation. Uh, here's a few dollars for a tabletop. Let's do something really quick that will address your concerns. It doesn't. Meanwhile, Curtis says those who see the Trudeau government as green friendly may want to think again. I don't think you can you can call yourself green and at the same time be developing new oil projects. There just isn't a room for it. And you know, a, a colleague and and uh, saw a researcher actually who's done research on this uh, said at one point that you know talking about green oil is like talking about filtered cigarettes. They both cause cancer. There's no room for them if you want to avoid that. And in this case, the cancer is climate change. After demonstrating in front of federal court, the group moved on to the Norwegian embassy a few blocks away. Fraser Needham, APTN National News, Ottawa.